Yo, 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 it's your boy Dom on the Beats. We back at it. Part two. You know what I'm saying? We back in the hood. We out there, bitch. I'm gonna show you a little, little one, two, day, day, like a tattoo, you know what I'm saying? We out there, bitch, at the store right now, you know what I'm saying? We hanging out. Shout out to the boy. So that blow up. Yeah. TP, I'm born in 93, so I can't Failed. tell you too much, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Can't tell you too much. We was out your cause. Sure. Was, it ever, was it ever not safe to run these streets, Tangelo? We was safe. We was always safe. I'm saying for us. Was it, was it unsafe for us to be outside? See what I'm saying? The police. That was that's who that's yeah. that's what come on man. What's your experience living out here in Orlando? I've been out all these years. I've been out here all my life. I, my experience has been good, been bad, bro. See what I'm saying? Yeah, you got any you got any memorable bowlings living out here in Orlando you would like to tell the camera? Like something memorable that you can remember. Growing up over here, like something really memorable to you that you won't forget, like growing up over here. That might have been like um, places, historical places, things that y'all used to do over here. No, like, my, my greatest memorable uh, uh, of us growing, I mean growing up over here, niggas stood together. Yeah, so it, that changed out throughout the years? Okay, where, where, for sure, for sure. That's real. Y'all yeah, from the content? What? Yeah. 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 Oh, I ain't finished. Probably gonna ride around, get some more though. It just hit me, right? So, the massacres. Let me see if I can pull up the massacres right quick. All of the massacres. Y'all familiar? I know y'all familiar with the Tulsa, Oklahoma massacre. Yeah. Rosewood massacre. Um, Okoye massacre. This is right up the street right here. Y'all familiar with Okoye massacre? Yeah, yeah. All right. So, all of these massacres were Europeans. Uh, for this conversation, we're going to say black and white people. All the, the massacre was white people going on black people property killing them, burning their house down, and running them off their land. I just read to you about the Virginia Company of London. They said their most, valu they most um, valuable resource was land. They was running us off our land and reselling our land. My family was in Okoye in the 1900s. In 1902, this is a documentary called the Okoye Massacre. In 1902, Julius July Perry was a black land cropper, wealthy land cropper, and back then you had to pay to vote. Mm -hmm. He was paying for black people to vote Republican. Right. The Dixiecrats, the Democrats came in, killed them, killed some like 20 other black people, burned down a lot of homes, and ran black people out of court. Black people didn't return to court in 1986. Mm. Did you get that? I need to do that? No, I got that, I got that. Okay. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Black people didn't return to 1986, right? So. With these massacres that was happening, these weren't slaves. These weren't people that was enslaved and then came out of slavery and acquired 300 acres of land. Mm -hmm. These was American Indians who always been on that land, who was ran off their land. Because mm. my family was there. And that's how we ended up from McCoy to Kissimmee, Florida. You go look on the census. My uncle told me I had to go look for myself. You go look on the census, you'll see my family there in McCoy. So we had our 40 acres in the mule. They ran us off our land. Mm -hmm. That's what the whole reparation, they talking about the 40 acres in the mule. It ain't they, we asking for something, we asking for it back. We ain't asking for no handouts to get, we want it back. We want our land back. That's what it's all about. Yeah, so. yeah man. So if you got a people thinking they come from Africa on a slave ship and they not fighting for the land, meanwhile, your biggest asset is selling land. <laughs> And now you see who own all the land. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. yeah real. White man own everything. And it's been said many times they gave us the Bible and took our land. And that's just what it is. And they gave us new names. No. <laughs> they didn't give you new names. Look. All right. If you go to Russia, you go to Poland, you go to Scotland, you go to Ireland, you think you're going to find Williams over there, Johnson over there? What's the Ireland last name? Shit, I don't even know. I never okay. <laughs> McDonald. McCarley is going to be something like that. What's a Russian last name? I just, some, you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. So they came over here. They married into our family and they took on our names. And then that land became day land. That was another way of taking our land, marrying into our families. And that's where the mulatto, the whole mulatto thing came about. The mixture. Yeah. Rub nigga shit. And we just been divided and conquered. Haitians, Jamaicans, Dominican, Puerto Ricans, the whole Caribbeans, they Americans. Yeah, they've been mixed with other things, but 
They Taino, they are, they're American Indian. Those are islands. This is the mainland. This is not foreign. This is the mainland. And we all Americans and we've been divided and conquered. Just because we speak different dialects, you speak a different dialect because that's who conquered you. Like I say, them people in Africa that speak the two languages or more, they speak the language of their colonizer and they speak their original tongue. Yeah. Yo, yo, what it is, what it is. What's up, man? Sounds low. Yes, sir. Right here. I've been here my whole life. <laughs> man, uh, oh, I've man. been here since the laundromat right there in the okay. uh, little nightclub, Black Gold. What years was this? Oh, 93, guys. This is in the 70s. 70? Yeah, that's in the 70s. 20th for my time. Okay. 70 yeah, uh, if I'm not mistaken, the DJ name was Jam a lot. From what I was told, I, I was too young to know a DJ, but I, I remember sitting in that laundry mat. That right there. That's a million dollar stroll right there. What's that? Show, show, show. Yeah, millions of dollars. Uh, that, that's tourists from out of, out of state, out of country, coming right here. They don't, they don't want to know what Paramore Mercer Drive Tupac, is. Tupac, all of them. They, right they want to know where's Tanzo Park. Yeah. Tupac, I told so you. That's a million dollar <laughs> stroll right there. I'm glad you brought it up. Not to cut you off. Oh. <laughs> Tupac, they all come through here. Cause like oh, I said, we, we, we surrounded by the tourists. We surrounded by the tourists. I got a, so I got a song. I got a song called International all that we write off up. International. Well, I'm from Tanzania. Write off International. I'm so international. So the song makes sense to the city. Yeah, we right here in the heart. They can sit us the island, Tanzania Park. We sit by ourselves. Big ass Therefore, we can only beef with one another when it is trouble, which is unnecessary. So if we was all together, you, you see how powerful we'd be. Because we're an island. we by ourselves. Really? Yeah, go, ass, going we, up. We, 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 we wore small, Nikes. Right. We were known for wearing um, Nikes okay. from Walker Jr. High yeah, yeah, on up. Uh, they're just facts. You know, yeah, yeah, if you was from Tesla, you wore Nikes. If you didn't have a pair, somebody was gonna lend you a pair. And that's how it went. For real? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you had to have Nikes. Uh Carl Shore were they were Converse. Uh I'm not too familiar with what other neighborhoods were wearing, but it was a culture thing. Uh respect. I never saw nobody out here running around with no shoes on. His mom could whoop me, my mom could whoop him. It was a village. That had went for everybody. <laughs> you know what um, mannerism. Nah, we was taught that. Keep birth. going back. You gonna keep hearing what I told you. Brother. The news. The news will show you some messy stuff, but I'm just giving you the facts. Right. All of us were raised the right way. We might have made wrong choices. I did 20 years in prison behind Roy, wrong choices. So. So like the, the the cycle, like, you know, people, you know, you said you did 20 years. I know you recently said you did some time as well. Like the cycle, like, why do you think it's like a continuous cycle when it comes to like, you know, people living in like the inner cities and stuff like that? You mean the cycle as far as getting incarcerated and stuff? Yeah, for sure. Because I know like you being the OG, I'm pretty sure, you know, you had done gave knowledge to the young cats and all that. And, you know, being their age, I know you, you probably... We, we, we were raised up on a different temptation. Our mm. temptation was... He Get got a thousand dollars in his Get pocket. Money. He's Get money. twelve years old. Get money. I'm That's struggling it. trying to stop the ice cream man. So now Get money. it's a temptation thing, mm -hmm. and it don't sound real, but it is. Um, we had some guys out here dress up like Disney characters and rob hey. Disney World. Oh, See, it's 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 a lot of history out here. Things that took place that won't take place in life. You know, it's coming from product the product environment, man. The yeah. bottom line. It's a different. The ones it's I middle from. tourists with nothing, no resources, no nothing. Best thing about living over here is that you can easily get a job. Bro. Easily. Yeah, type shit. Easily. Bitch. I mean, yeah, back then, back then. I mean, back I got then, plenty of them up. Hold on, bro. Now, back nowadays, then, a house was 600 a month. Nowadays, y'all don't different. know about back then. And, and, and minimum wage was 425 an hour. You yeah. hear what I'm saying? Yeah. 425 an hour. I told you, they call me cool. Yes, yeah. 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 Now, I mean, it's like $15, but still, how much rent out here now? $2,000 a month, $2,500 a month. 
rent by two, three. Yeah, so there. come on, man. Yeah, this this legendary grounds, but you know it, it it's worse. It take the residents, the residents <laughs> to know it. The people that's yeah. risen from here, oh, yeah. explain the legendary grounds. Oh, Everybody out here is a good person. Everybody is a good person. Let me ask. Uh, Danny, any uh, when we was out here, we was out here on the streets, right? Whether you were doing bad or not, who was your worst? Who was our worst enemy? <laughs> Uh, who, 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 we say would, ourselves. No, no. I'm uh, saying who we, neighborhood wise. Yeah. No, not neighborhood. I'm just saying in general. In general, I gotta give you some more. Who was our biggest threat? Let me get that one time. I'm trying to understand the question. You mean as far as us doing wrong? No, you ain't even have to be doing wrong. Police? Yeah. That's always, I yeah, mean. Yeah, I'm just saying, the Duke boys. You ain't even yeah, have to be man, doing it wrong. We could just be chopping it up like we chopping it up now. Nah. Just talking. Oh, yeah, yeah. Harass, that's, ain't that's, no harass. They come in and they slamming I mean, you, they all. kicking yeah, that's, you, that's, they that's, beating that's, you. That's, 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 that's a whole yeah. different. Yeah, yeah. yeah. jump yeah. out, bro. Yeah, yeah, that's that's yeah. different. That's that's and that's, that's what we that, went through, though. Yeah, we we yeah, I could, I could collaborate on that. What I don't happened. know about nobody else, but that's what made me the way that I am today. We was we was invaded. Oh, damn, all that. We was invaded. I call it invaded. I don't trust them. Don't we, deal we was invaded by the so-called Duke boys, which I later in life found out they just officers from jail, thirty third. But if you look in that. Inside the store with the bed, the cooler. Yeah. The Duke boys be back there taking pictures of us. You ain't sell them nothing. They in the cooler taking pictures, and they indict you like that. They came on the ice cream truck. They came on the ambulance. You all. They came in different ways where we the only neighborhood in the only city was experiencing that stuff. They weren't. They weren't doing that nowhere else. And we talking about. All the way from the early 80s on up to where you go in the store to buy you a soda, the police back there taking a picture of you. Now, at indictment time, they got a picture of you saying the S and D. So, you know, there's a lot we had to go through. Out there. There's a lot. Like we had a little beef with Carver showing the rich my height, but our biggest threat was the police department. Now we all good. Now it's all love. Now it's older than mine. I ain't never had them problems. Yeah, me either. Me either. See, I moved here from a different city, so the whole time they were beef, I ain't never had none of them. Me either. It's just, just, I look at more of the good. I, 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 I collaborate more on the good of the hood, but they all tell you, man, you be dead broke. It's about forty dollars. Come to the same store, big dice game in the store, and leave with two thousand dollars, three thousand dollars. Right. Or you go to any corner and get in the dice game, the card game. I experienced it different was, from her because she was locked in the house and she couldn't experience. We was, it was out different. There. And she was young. She came way out. Hey, how you doing today, man? Right, well, no. well. All right, all right, all right. I want to say, man, a long little juice, different. man. Long little Blake. You know what I'm saying? On a little trout. Man, we say his name him all day, man. Kato. That's a nun ending thing, man. You don't want to leave nobody out. So yeah, it's a, it's it's a nun ending thing. We're going all day know, with that. You know, I, I, I know what you're saying. saying. You know what I'm saying? But just on the real, cause it it'll be unfair to some. You right. So we right. say R.I.P. to all the right, 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 right. you know, right. good dudes, you right. man. Definitely gonna miss somebody. Yeah, you right. You right. Died right. in vain, man. Well, so, yeah, yeah. Rest peace to everybody. We yeah. lost for real. We lost Too a lot of people. For, we lost a lot of people. Took some life. Bullshit. <laughs> like real <right there>, bullshit. <laughs> it's life though. You know what I'm saying? You try to just stay out of trouble as possible. You can. Well. Shit, real. Bro. Not, it's not it's not everybody crazy, dying man. from health, from diabetes and health, health related issues. Yeah, that's the new killer. It's crazy, bro. Like it, it's. I can share a few things, man. No, go ahead. Anybody, anybody trying to be in that street life, you ain't that. You got to work extra hard to be that, man. So stay out the streets. Yeah, for sure. That's just real talk. You I ain't that. So, so now you gotta work extra hard to become a street dude. Nah, that ain't even what's popping. That ain't even what's. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Leave it alone. That ain't even... Yeah, man. Entrepreneurship, yeah, yeah. investment. That's what time it is, man. Investing in your life. I, I did 20 years in prison, man. If I ain't hear about a dude from in there, then you're not that. So stop trying to be that. That's it, though. It's a small place. Ain't nothing but floor that's shaped like a gun. <laughs> and the prison go from the top to the bottom of the map, so everybody know everybody. 
throughout the years. So look, I was anybody cutting up you hear it enough. I was in the only state prison in the state of Florida. There's only one state prison. <laughs> TPP. That's Florida man. State Prison. The rest of the We got like six or seven correctional institutes, but we only got one state prison. That's where all the death row inmates and everything be at. Yeah, I don't know half of these folks, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. 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 What? Hey, you you come get on this <laughs> okay, man. They the future, man. Those are TPVs out here, man. The YGs, man. They the future, man. You gotta embrace them, man. For real. I love them, man. The kids of the future, hey. man. For real. Yeah, but man, the same energy, the same love you see, bro. Tangelo always been like that, man. So that's what I was just saying. When she talking about it was unsafe, bro, like, it's always been like this for us, bro. We always had, it's always been love. Like that man say, if you ain't had no Nike, somebody gonna lend you something, bro. It's always been love out here. I ain't gonna say his name, but he can call for sure, man. Hey, much love on the tree. Keep doing your thing, bro. Man, it's all love, man, from everywhere around here, man. Hood to hood, man. You know what I'm saying? Real they be like smooth. Real time with like, Teach me how to nugget. I'm gonna get on the camera, do a little one too. Man, I'm gonna get on the camera. That nigga's too young for the nugget. I invented the nugget. Get on the camera, tell them about some Tesla little history. Huh? Tell them about some Tesla little history, huh? Well, he don't know nothing about it. <laughs> said, yeah. said what? Yeah, hey. He don't know nothing about it. Tell, tell him about it. I've been here since 72. You said what again, huh? I've been here since 72. 72? So what you seen here? I ain't seen, huh? 72, what you ain't seen, you'll never see. When we moved out here in Tangelo, all of this wasn't even over there. There wasn't even no road over there. It was one way in Tangelo, one way out. International Drive was one hotel. Wow. It was called the High Q. Then you had Jerry Restaurant. So everything you see, from this way all the way past Disney and the mall right there, I watched it grow. Mm. That's a fun fact. 72. 72. I'm 1993. Yeah, y'all weren't even born. I wasn't even born. He feminine. He wasn't even born either. <laughs> 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 but you know what? Hey, there's nothing like Tangelo. Boy, I love this. Huh? The Du Bois? Oh yeah, oh man, the Du Bois wasn't nothing to be messed up with, man. They used to come, they 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 they, they, they used to come out here on the city bus. Then they used to back in here, and um, you know it was the Du Bois because they leave the latch a loose on the back of the truck. So when they um lift it up, that's when they come out and get you. They they run a steam. They'll come out here and tell you, oh, y'all ain't got to sell no dope out here. Really the day we selling the dope, today, everybody they got. My really tell you what they was. Yeah. Well, this was a 7-Eleven right here. Uh, what else? That was 7-Eleven. Then all the part were added on right there. It was the um, um, American Legion. Then you go around the curve, we had the black gold. That's then cool. after that, then we had the washer mat. But Tango, all that was an empty field over there. So we used to play football over there and stuff. Oh, got to go. Somebody you got to get out. Appreciate yes, it. Thank you, man. All right, man. Yes, sir. Do the Patterson crowd here, Brooklyn. They broke the chain. See how we stand here? You ain't got to be selling. I don't need to talk cars. He might take off running. They gonna grab you and slam you. I don't need to talk cars. They need your back. They're all behind your back. I'm a dog wanting that bitch. That bitch gets swiped, but the importance. You know what I'm saying? What the hell going on? Talk your shit, man. What you mean talk that shit? You give me no shit. It is what it is. Ain't no shit talking about this stuff. You know what I'm saying? For sure, for sure. Key to a D, man. OG shit. Okay then. Tell them about Tanlo, like what you, know what I'm saying? Man, what yeah, you remember Tanlo? Been out here on this yeah, street. Yeah, I, I, I don't, don't, don't even want to tell them. They better know that. They got to know that. But these folks don't know. You feel me? They got to know that. With the TPG, if you from the TPG, it's a part of you. It's branded on you. It was real. Okay then. Okay then. Yeah. Yeah. You had this. I had to. I, I see. I was in. I was in the feds all in Kentucky, so I had to let it be known.
I never said Orlando. I said Tangelo. Yeah. Juvenile said Magnolia. I said Tangelo. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I told the truth. I got dudes in other states know about Tesla right now, bro. That's what I talk long Logged in. I ain't gonna talk on. You got that shit logged in. Something up. Something up. I'm real. Call you to the side. It's PG. Straight up. Can't make this up. Hey, proof. All the way out with it, man. Everyday life, man. You know, we just be hanging out. You never know who you'll pop up and see. You know what I'm saying? Oh, next up, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let them, let them explain to everybody. Explain my game. I'm sorry, go fish. I'm going to get you to go on that level nowadays. This is a producer, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, you're the producer, too? Yeah, I'll be talking about it. Man, we got a network. Well, for real. Yeah, you got me. I already know it, bro. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I know you say that. They got a real team. Let me hear some shit, right? I got you. I'm going to get you a spot, YG. Say you do it's music. Yeah. Let's go ahead. Yo. Hey. What you want me to do? Yeah, get on camera too, Yeah, you're going bro. the wrong hey, way, man. Tell you who you is, who Let you are. Let the people come know come your come position come in this music real. game. Hey. Real. Right here. This is my little brother right here. This is my networking man right here. Anything you need, anything I need, he hit me up. You feel me? Okay. <laughs> Alright, so what y'all want to hear? I can kick it acapella. What you want? How you want it? Whatever okay, you don't skip me, the brother. Hold up. Explain oh, who everybody shit. My is. Fault, my fault, my fault. Hey. This also right here, big bodyguard shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm just playing. This my brother right here, man. I just want to say been, this before hey, you go. Forever, you know what I'm saying? This my little, this little brother, nigga. Big one. I didn't get big and small and shit. You feel me? Same shit, man. Been around since we was kids, you know what I'm saying? We just trying to build this, build it. You know what I'm saying? Turn nothing into something. You feel me? Trying to turn TP into on. You know what I'm saying? TOP on top. You feel me? So rock with us. M O W B shit. So whatever you do, just remember it worldwide. Worldwide. So do you do it? Make it look good. That's all I want to say. You feel me? All right. I don't want to put no pressure. I just want to let it be. All right. Hold up. Hold up. Now, immigrant. Hey, y'all, get in there. Get in there. I'm gonna say this. Yeah, like Every one of these boys graduated together. Come on, so we ain't gonna leave that part yeah, out. Nah, See, they graduate nowadays. Yeah, going to school. Yeah, and they're still in college. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, doing the rap thing too. Know what I'm saying, bro. So you ain't got to be game banging and all that, though, man. You get it in the right way. That's what I'm talking about, bro. I'm telling you. What y'all want to get in the Oh, shit. Uh, let me tell you. Right. Hold on. Uh, Ballin' not the whiff and shit. Drunk but won't admit the shit. Hennessy all on my breath, but fuck the shit. We still lit. New freak that been dancing on me. Tongue kiss her little friend. Man, I'm shot before the song. So you know I'm getting in. Pull it in. Ah, but hold on. My fault, my fault, my fault. I fucked it up. One more time, one more time, one more time. I say, falling out the whip and shit. Drunk, but won't admit the shit. Hennessy all on my breath, but fuck the shit. We still lit. New freak that been dancing on me. Tongue kiss her little friend. Madam shot before the function. So you know I'm getting in. Brought my dogs into the function. So you know we mobbing shit. What you wanna do? I get it in. I got extended clip of F and I let it rip. Like this blade blazer shit. I hop up in, hop in the solo. I get it lit. Ah, damn, fuck, yeah. I'm fucked. Yeah. Hey, man, I've been rapping all night, man. I just came from the studio. Y'all already know, man. I just had look, look so sweet, look so sweet, and then Mo, it's Mark J on everything, M O B B J A A Y, man. I get you right. Hold on, let me play some shit. I can't go out like that. I gotta play y'all some real shit, bro. I gotta come on, bro. I gotta let you hear it, bro. Come on, bro. We just set the microphone up right now. You wanna do it? Let's do it. Let's do it. He ain't fucking up either. Come on, let's do it. I got one for real. Come on, let's do it. I been staying in the trunk. All right. What up, bro? Uh, yeah. What's up, what's up, what's up? That was shit, this is real. Let's do it. Right there on the front. Get your bitch, I'm fat. Tell him what you want. Okay, find y'all on social media. Go ahead, let them know. Bro, you already know. Chill with my homie Jay right now. You know, we vibing, man. After tonight, we finna go to, um... What's your Instagram Love and shit. My Instagram? Yeah. My Instagram, Tyler Johnson 109. I'm finna change that shit soon, though. What up? My name is Darius. My Instagram is Darius, but the it's D-X-R-I-O-U-S. Go follow me. Oh, we got to pick up the mic. Ooh, y'all showing up. Turn up then, man.
It's the future of the hood, man. This shit, man. This is top right now. It's a free show right now, bro. This shit. And it's the last time. I'm so full of lean, down there about to fall over. Chuck a pill in the drink, down there everything was sober. Supercharged in the road, but my heart cold as Minnesota. I could fuck you, but not love you, babe. My heart is barely over. I be walking around with dog shit, I could barely hold it. Baby Drake, you retarded, I could barely hold it. Taurus hit his target, don't got a horoscope. I might put a switch in 50 cal and leave the torso open. It's got me walking crazy, this that cake walk. All them kids hit his face, nigga, that's that drink talk. Watch his pants so damn hard, that's that cake walk. Stick them there, fell out his van so Harley can't walk. She had something to say, but, but she ain't even talk. It's about 60 girls, it's me and gang, and we all in it. This bitch, she thick as hell, but really suck at giving talk. She got a man, but then I creep up on his block. This nigga is such a damn scene, I'm gonna post it up at BNB. She said, hello, I said, over here, ain't where you supposed to be. She get happy as hell when I blow this jam up in the sprite. I get high this morning, you won't see me till tonight. She said, oh, and Jason won't get geek like me, I. She said, can I taste it? Won't get geek like me tonight. OMG, she's such a freak, so the pill still on her tongue. I get shit done. Tell you where we from. I'm from Tangelo, right off in the national. Definitely, I'm swinging national. He gon' eat it, he gon' starve, don't wanna starve, become a thief New kid on the block, he catch a stain, oh yeah, he might fit in Nigga see my face from out that window, end up just like Ricky Tap the switch without me looking, think that I got aim by Break his jaw for talking shit, what made him say he smoking hot? Yo, yeah, yeah. that's it This is what I'm gonna be, yeah You know what I'm saying? We just hanging out, you know what I'm saying? It's just a little vibe we just put together, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah Red bone in the cut, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's tangible shit, you know what I'm saying? We just hanging out. We got it, got the TPBs out there, big, you know what I'm saying? What, Koopies? Finna spit some shit, Koopies? Oh shit, I ain't got no shit on. Man, spit some shit. Man, that's a little song. Acapella? Acapella then. Acapella then. Let's hear your bar, nigga. Spit that shit, nigga. No beat. No beat? No beat. I got no on beat. this side, cause the sun is no there. No beat. Sun's better on this side. No beat, nigga. No beat? No beat. Where is this heat? Let me see that. Where is this heat so I spit rhyme? Real, real nigga, straight street shit. I get mine, I get down, I spit rhyme. Straight New York shit, I get lines. Fuck with me, I put your ass in the ground, six feet down. Roll the mustards, 
Rolling Heat. I don't even need a mic. Go ahead, go ahead, keep it. Realest nigga in the street. Yeah. TPG, yeah. you already know what it be. Block them up, block them down. Real nigga making real nigga sound. Hold them down. Face off yeah, fast. Yeah. We in this shit. No face, no mask. No face, no case. No face, no trace. You understand what the fuck that I say? I yada that I mean because I yada that I clean. I keep the doors open like I swing four fours. You keep that shit on the beam. You feel me? Cannon on the camera. Cannon on the weight. I wake these niggas up. That's a wake and bake. I make that shit shake like it was cake. Fat cake, fat booty. Fat chick, fat monkey. I'm in this shit counting fast money. You want this shit? Come get it, honey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Angelo Paul was established in 1957. 30 minutes later. Yeah. This is Seville. 24 hours, 7-11. We ain't have no street light. We ain't have no sidewalk. We had Tangelo, uh, Tangelo Elementary School. With all the people went there, but people in Tangelo Park. And wait, come on, man. They want to send the kids out here in Bay Hill. We voted against sending our kids over there when it was a school out here. This was a 24 hour 7 Eleven. I worked there you know, from 11 to 7. Everybody ever skate. Everything over there was dark, dark, dark. We had uh, South Central. We had a laundromat. We had uh, uh, an arcade. We had uh, the Black Gold. We had. We had a bus stop, we had four phone, three phone booths right here, two over there. The Teddy Low Park Baptist Church started right there on Andrew, on the corner of Andrew, on the right hand side, there was Tangelo Baptist Church. That's where it started from. Right there. They left from Tangelo Baptist Church and started in the front part of Tangelo Baptist Church. The front part, the other part wasn't built. Tangelo Baptist Church was right there on the corner of Andrew and Mandarin. Started right there in Tangelo Park. We had the uh, cows, horses, and everything. They used to stink out here. You don't stink no more. We just don't got used to it. But I'm saying <laughs> the thing. We had the, the YMCA. They could play ball. They go swimming when they get out of school. They, you, they get in the pool. They go swimming when they get out of school. Over there to, to the basketball. They had a, a, a 12 o'clock midnight fit, football, uh, basketball, and everything. Over there to the wild. Now they can't even go over there and even. I already know that. It, they don't tore it down, but I'm saying then, before they tore it down, y'all could go there. It was dead only for the senior citizens. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It was only for the senior citizens. Y'all couldn't get in the pool. Y'all used to go get in the pool and y'all get out of school up until 4 o'clock. Oh, God. I was on this one too. That's right. Up and then oh, they could God. play basketball. They ain't had midnight basketball. They could play basketball <laughs> at midnight. My son, Bakari, he's the coach. For the Tangelo Park girls and boys team, one of the girls, Jackie Johnson, daughter, she got three gold basketball from Tangelo Park Tigers basketball team. She, she was the only girl on that at first, but he was trying to get a basketball. She got three every time they win a tournament, she get a six hundred dollar check. He got all six hundred dollar checks that she got in a frame for her. He told her. When she if she went to college, he would give it to her. Other than that, it was for the he, he got he got him in a frame. He said, other than that, it's it's, it's a uh, statue for all the people on the team. But she was a three shooter. What whoop that is? But Tangelo Park, <laughs> Tangelo Park. This is Tangelo Park, Florida. Three two eight one nine. We is not in Orlando. We is on the outskirts. We is in a different neighborhood. And him right here. Look, they were little old boy. His bo him and his brothers. They was going to tell him. They were little old boy. His brother preacher now, he's a minister. Mm -hmm. Trenton Carson, he's all Trenton Carson, he's a ministry. He go all over the world preaching to young people. That's a fact. That's a fact. That's a fact. If you know, you know, you know what I'm saying? Man you get lit. So growing up, what was things you guys like to do out here? You know, was it like sports or events or you know, uh, what you call it, like after school programs, any of that? Shit, yeah, to do? it was like we used to like shit. Growing up, we would run around like we used to play manhunt and shit. Like manhunt, we used to just just fuck around, riding our bikes and shit, hitting our drive. We used to go to fun spot, just riding around. We used to end up be everywhere, like. But I hear we used to have this program at the YMCA. Uh, I forgot what that bill was called. What was it called? Um, Midnight. Basketball Midnight, some shit like that. 
Yeah, we used to go out that bed uh, and ball and shit. But they shut that shit down, man. We used to, we used to have so much shit. Wayne Brady, if you know Wayne Brady, this Wayne Brady people house. Um, Wayne Brady, if you know, you know. You know what I'm saying? It's Tangelo, though. We got Dwight Howard. Uh, uh, what? Mama-in-law, ex-wife, whatever how you want to say it. They from around here, too. So you up up yeah, and see Howard's son out here sometimes. They be playing ball in the front yard. Howard's son, yeah, yeah. So how big is his neighborhood? Like, what's the... Man, I don't even know. To me, it's real small, but it could be big to someone else. But it's real small. Um, From that to that front where we were just at, yeah. and it goes, like, it's not that big, though. I'm gonna go to the church. I'll show you the church real quick. The church right here. All right, a little bit of everybody went to this church, probably. Football, football, yeah, for sure. I can show you the little backfield, too. It's the church, the Temple Park Baptist. It's the Temple Baptist Church. You know what I'm saying? Back of us too now. So what was there before they had built that? Straight woods. It was like trees. We used to cut through. I ain't never cut through. I ain't gonna lie. I was always scared of that. But I know my friends always used to cut through ride bikes, dirt bikes, all kinds of shit through there. And these be straight trees. It used to be a way to cut through to get the eye drive. Yeah, yeah, I was always scared. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't never going that bitch. I was scared. Yeah, I heard that one story right there, and I was like, hell, nah, I ain't going that bitch. I was a little fat, a little something too, boy. I am not, boy, playing around. I ain't, boy. It was number trees in that bitch. But they, um, somebody grabbed that bitch, put some houses in that bitch, no? He, he did he like on the land or he just lived back there type? Yeah, I, know, I think Cubs just living back that bit, boy. He was just yeah, like, John Deere, all that in the back over there too. Man, that bit dug it. Yeah, it's the back of the church right here. It's, it's, it's where we did football games and stuff. And we do uh, get backs here too. We got a get back coming up on the 27th. Well, well, let them know what that is so they could. Uh, you want to pop out? Yeah, it's on the 27th. I can see the fly and stuff. I got you. You ready? Yeah, you ready. Go ahead. My name is Wendell Swain. Better known as real nigga Dale. I've been in San Antonio since '67. Nah, nah, this is like the, like the greatest, the great. It could be a great neighborhood. I mean, we had, I used to have a lot of fun out here, but now lately, I mean, people need to learn how to get together. That's one of the biggest, big, biggest downfalls with our neighborhood right now. If we would learn to stick together, this would be the greatest place in the world. But right now, y'all see what's happening. White folks trying to run us out. I was growing up over here back in the day. Back in the day, it was sweet. Mm. What was things to do? Party, it was a whole lot to do. Yeah, parties and everything that you go to. Nowadays, you can't even go to a party. Everybody around here, want, 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 they're carrying a gun, think, think the gun make them. Guns don't make them. Guns make fools. Mm -hmm. They got to learn how to be grown men. And part of being grown men, you got to learn how to make real decisions. Life is about choices, man. Everything you do is, is by choice, not by force. You can never tell anybody made you do nothing. It's all your choice. It all comes down to you. So what you, why do you think it started um, getting like that when it comes to people, you know, you're saying that people used to party, hang out, now it came to like violence. Like, why do you think it started transitioning in that? The transition came when, when white folks started, when people started telling them, telling them they, they can't beat their kids. The Bible says, spare the rod, spare the child. You know what I mean? How can they, they dictate how you raise your kids? I'm gonna tell you why they do that. They do that because here in Florida, Florida got things called they call the prison system. They make more money off their prison system than they do all of their tourists. That's what, what time it is. That's why they don't parents beat the kids. As long as parents don't raise their kids, they gotta play for them. You know what I mean? But it's not gonna benefit the parents or, or, the, or the child. It's gonna benefit them. So now I'm telling all, all the young folks, y'all need to get wild. I mean, I listen to rap, but y'all need to listen to the whole song. And pay, and pay attention to what's really being said. Because there's a lot of things in this world that y'all don't know. Especially when it comes to black and white, 
I mean, I'm not prejudiced, but hell, it is what it is, you know. Y'all need, the best thing they can do for themselves here in the world today is to educate themselves. I mean, biblically, especially biblically, because without God, we ain't gonna never, we ain't gonna make, we ain't gonna make, y'all yeah. see what's what happening. They taking, taking God, taking God off, off money, so you know where, where the country's going. Why do you think they doing that? Man, they don't want people to believe in God. Huh? To them, God is a myth. But to me, I know God is real. Then they did that. I've been pronounced dead twice. God say no. It's not up, up to man, man. That's why you tell these people, y'all walk around with your guns, thinking y'all scare people. I don't give a damn how many times you shoot a person. You ain't leaving this world until God says it's your time. Up, that, that's what happened, that's, that's, the real, that's the real issue. If you give advice to the young generation right now, something that you know you probably experienced and you learned from it from when you was growing up, what would it be? My, my real advice for young people today, they need to get to know God, get to know who you really is. You understand know I me? Mean? And listen to your parents. They can't always be wrong. They've been there, did that. They be telling them things to keep them going, going the wrong way. But you know, some, most people, got, they got to be hard-headed. They want to experience things on their own. And when they find out, it's too late to say, oh, oh, I'm sorry. So, if y'all really want to know something about life in general, yeah. pick up that good book. And then they're going to stay wrong. And if y'all prove God a lot, then I'm, I'm with you. But I know you can't. What life experience you been through that made you start realizing that you know God was real? Cause you know you said you, you said you've been you died almost died twice, right? Yeah, man, I almost drowned once. Okay, so what experience have you been through in this life that made you realize God was real? When I got burned, the girl throws me grease on and believe it or not, I, what year was that? Like '99. Believe it or not, bro, when I, when, they, when you throw the grease on me, I didn't feel it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I I refused to go to the hospital. I stayed away from the hospital for three days. When I went to the hospital, they were telling me, oh, burn you. I said, man, this shit happened three days ago. They tell me, oh, ain't no way a human can withstand that much, that much pain for three days. What degree burns was it? First degree. First thing. And they were talking about how well, a human can't withstand. But if you don't believe in God, you put no trust in that man, no, you, no, you can't withstand it. You know what I'm saying? Right now today, man, I do a lot of things, you know. I'm not living right, according to what does says the Lord. But I thank God I'm not, not Living the way I used to live, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The older you get, the wiser you get. Yeah. Okay. To these days, as, as you real life, but you learn. The greatest thing they need to learn how to do is respect one another. That word respect goes a long way. They're able to learn respect out here than to learn in there. For real. For sure. For that, y'all keep your heads up and try to live life to the fullest. For sure. Thank you for that, man. Word up. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to Kodak Blow Up, man. I'm too high, man. We at Taylor right now, man. Dom on the beat, man. We just did some fire documentary, man. We out here in the hood, man. Chopping it up about the history, you know what I'm saying? About our OGs out, you know what I'm saying? And the YG, they did a performance. No, man, I didn't even expect none of that, man. That was lit, though. I really, man, that was dope. But yeah, man, tangible with it. It's just day by day. It's, it's what go down, you know what I'm saying? Sorry. Don't talk your shit. Lockheed Martin, we want our money, man. <laughs> yeah. We want our check, man. Y'all been putting all them chemicals Give and everything up in there, man. Getting all this cancer and stuff. We want our no check, orders, man. No, Morgan and Morgan. Yeah. Lockheed Martin, man. Y'all stop playing, man. Cut that check, man. I definitely want my money, man. Hey, hey, hey. Hold on. Go. Oh, no. You got you. Got, you got stuff. Oh. <laughs> Bro, you, you, that big gonna be a movie. I'm trying to tell you, boy, that big old boy coming to you live you from it. <laughs> Let me tell you a story back when I was a G. <laughs> <laughs>